Yo, what is up? This is Joshua Casper. Welcome to another Ableton Live Very Quick Tip. This one's on finding media files, just in case you didn't know. Um, as you can see, I've opened up my, my project here, and all of my files are missing. And um, if it's a very complicated file and you can't see that these are blanked out, uh, this will highlight down here in this nice shade saying, media files are missing. Please click here for more information. So when I click here, it opens the missing media files directory and it says 10 of the reference files are missing. Um, I could do an automatic search, which could take a long time, or I could, if I happen to know where my files are, which I do, um, I could just come in and I could just take one and drop it to where it's supposed to go. So right here, um, I've got the base and I'm going to drop it on the base right here. Boom. And luckily, all of my files are in the same folder. And it says, your set project stills missing files. Should Live try to resolve all the missing files based on the location of the file you placed? And all the other files are in here, so I say yes. And it finds them all for me. It says nine new ca candidates were found and nine were replaced automatically. I hit OK, and we're good to go. So, um, if you didn't know how to do that, that's a good way to do it. Um, also, if, there, if you don't know where the files are, I suggest using the Finder um, to find your projects. It's, for me, it seems to work a lot quicker than um, using Live's Finder. But hopefully in 9, that problem is, has been fixed. But for us in 8, using the Finder in your operating system is a lot quicker. Or seems to be for me, anyway. Anyway, I hope that helps you guys. Peace.